Confused people don't buy. Make sure you're conveying clearly and consistently what you're all about. Let's talk about brand consistency across the, across the board on all your social media channels, all your marketing efforts. Now branding by a lot of small business experts is considered a waste of time. It's something that uh, big companies do. They call it brand marketing. But the reality is we live in a very visual driven world today. And if your marketing message isn't consistent and isn't branded consistently across the board, you're gonna create a lot of brand confusion and people aren't gonna know who you are and people aren't gonna recognize you as easily as they would if you followed some basic branding principles. And the first thing I wanna talk about is just that, keeping your brand consistency. If you're using you know, a certain color and a certain color scheme, don't radically switch to another color scheme, right? If your colors are blue, or, or, or blue don't go to you know, like green unless there's like, again, some specific strategy and intelligent thought behind it. Sometimes it's just you're being careless. You're being careless about the colors that you choose, about the fonts, you're not, you don't have a consistent logo. And not to say that that's the most important thing, but it definitely hurts your brand if you have a crappy looking website with a crappy looking social media profile and you have 10 different freelancers working uh, on your stuff from Fiverr, that's not gonna do you any good. That's gonna hurt your brand consistency because it makes you look careless. It makes you look like people, like you don't care about the way you look. and you don't care about the little details, right? So again, if you're using a certain type of font and over here you're using a different kind of font, different colors, different, your whole thing is inconsistent. And not only that, it'd be different if that were the only inconsistency, but your messaging needs to be consistent as well. Because you don't have clarity on who your customer is, you kind of just tend to ramble and put things uh, put things out there and see if they stick. So keep your brand message consistent, keep your colors consistent. One of the key things that I learned was to listen to my customers and exactly how they talk, right? When I'm listening to a customer explain their problem to me, I write down exact word for word how they explain that problem because now I can use that verbiage in my marketing message because we tend to use all these fancy terms that are in our industry, how we communicate, right? But that doesn't necessarily connect with our customer because they don't have, uh, they don't understand the industry lingo, but they'll know what the problem is and they'll explain it to you, right? So to give you an example, sometimes people will come, hey, I need help with all this internet stuff, right? That's how they identify, they just tend to clunk everything into internet stuff, right? Um, and that's a very simple example, but there's different things that a, a customer will say. Just listen to what they say, listen to how they say it, and try to say it as uh, close to that as, as how your customer communicates their problems, their needs, their wants, their desires. Hey there, I hope you enjoyed this video. Did you know there's 28 million small businesses in the United States, but 22 million of them make under $45,000 a year gross. Now that sucks, which is why we created this channel, why we're shooting these videos, because we wanna help more businesses succeed. The way you can do that, the way you can help us do that is by commenting, liking, and subscribing. Also sharing this with another business owner, another entrepreneur who may find it helpful. Number two is leave us a comment. Let us know how this has helped you or let us know uh, what kind of videos you'd like to see. Hey, every month, we're gonna be doing a free live training for you guys on marketing, sales, social media, really anything that's gonna help you grow your business. We're gonna be interviewing experts, we're gonna be bringing in the best people, other business owners, to share some of their best business advice and growth tips. So make sure you click the link and join us on our free live training.